Hello, and welcome to the Flurry tutorial on account management. In this video, we'll show you how to invite users to your Flurry account and manage the level of data access they have. Let's get started. There are three types of roles in Flurry. The first role is administrator. Account admins can view all data for the apps they are granted access to. They can perform all possible actions, such as adding new projects or creating segments. They also manage access to data for all other account holders for the apps they control. The second role is Developer. Developers can view all data for the apps they are granted access to and can perform most actions such as adding new projects or creating segments. They cannot manage or edit access to data for other account holders, but they can invite new members with their same developer level permissions. The third role is Viewer. Viewers can view all data for the apps they are granted access to. They are restricted from taking actions such as adding new apps to your account, creating segments, and so on. They cannot manage or edit access to data for other account holders, but they can invite new members with their same viewer level permissions. For a full list of actions permitted by role, please see our support site, support.flurry.com. To add a new user to your Flurry account, Select Manage or Invite at the top of the page from anywhere within the Flurry portal. If you are an account administrator, you will be taken to this page with a list of all your account members and their access levels. To add a new user, select Invite Users on the right-hand side of the page. If you are an account developer or viewer, you will be taken directly to this next page. First, enter in the email address of the new user. For this demo, we'll invite my colleague, John. Then select what level of access you want the user to have. If desired, a user can have a different level of access for analytics and advertising reporting as compared to user acquisition analytics. I'd like John to have developer level permissions for both. Please note that you can only add a new user with permissions up to your own role type. For example, if you are a viewer, you can only add other viewers to the account. You cannot add a new administrator. Finally, Select what apps you want the user to have access to. The default setting is all apps in your account. If you want to limit access to certain apps, select the Limit Application Access checkbox. At my company, John only works on Android Demo App, so I'll only allow him to have access to that application. Select Send you'll know you've successfully invited this person to your account when you see this confirmation appear. An email invitation will immediately be sent providing instructions on how to join. If you are an account administrator and want to edit a user permissions level at any point in time or delete a user from your account, simply go back to the Manage section, select Edit to the right of the user's name, and update the permissions as desired. That's it. Now you know how to manage your Flurry account. If you have any questions, you can always visit our support site or reach out to us at support at flurry.com. Thanks for watching.